we had a nice comment. I want to hit it up real quick. Pepper Moon saying she's really thankful for this show. And in the past, Flat Earth was hard to consider. All that explained said every. I guess she's talking about other people that try to explain it to her. Said everything is holographic and like the Matrix. This is a much better breakdown here. Appreciate that, Pepper. I mean, our goal is to show you how real it is. I too have seen those types of channels and videos and explanations you're talking about, and it's very Gnostic. It just flows right into Gnosticism, and that is why we started our first episode talking about the firmament because it gives you a firm grounding, all pun intended in every which way you want to take that. It gives you a firm grounding of the creation model the scriptures describe. See, what we've run into, or at least Wes, what I've run into in the past five, six years of hearing this topic, and when I became introduced to this topic, the first thing I heard was people disproving that we lived on a ball in space. And that was cool, right? That was mind-blowing. It was shattering, yeah. altering, right? Yeah. But they don't know where to go from there. They don't know the rest of the creation model descriptions. They stop there. Then they have to come up with all these other ideas to, okay, well, what is holding up the sun and the moon? Where is, what is going on? You know, is it some infinite plane or is it there, is it there's some sort of, so I've even heard some people say there is a firmament, but it's not, it's not enclosing around us like a dome, like the scriptures describe. It's just, it's another, just, infinite it's just another infinite yeah. plane above us that somehow the sun, moon and stars are attached to. They don't have the answers. This is the problem because they've they've taken a piece of what the creator described and they realize that's true, but they don't have his word because they weren't believers. So then they didn't know where to go to get the rest of the details. Wes and I decided this was a huge need in this community. So we want to give everyone the rest of the details because it's a beautifully succinct story that makes perfect sense with everything in the book, as well as everything we can observe, test and demonstrate. Yeah. So yeah, I'll stop preaching. We'll get going. No, you're fine, brother. Well <laughs> said. Well said. Thank you, Miss Pepper Moon. That was a, a beautiful comment. We appreciate that. That means so much. Well.